Hello viewers, welcome to my channel. This is Geeta. What is the value of square root of 729 plus square root of 72.9 plus square root of 7.29? So we have already discussed about how to remove the square root values. By that we know that square root of 729 is 27. So it comes like this. So square root of 729 plus writing 72.9 as a fraction. So it is 729 divided by so to write it as fraction the trick here is to check the number of decimal places so the decimal place here is one which means divided by one zero so that is 10 plus square root of same thing goes here check the number of decimal places so it is two so we have to divide it by two zeros which is 729 divided by 100 now that we know the square root of 729 is 27 write that as it is so this can be written like this which is square root of 729 divided by square root of 10 plus same thing goes here square root of 729 divided by square root of 100 i'm just explaining this for the beginners but those who know this can already skip the steps and directly find the answer so which is 27 plus now the square root of 729 again here is 27 divided by square root of 10 i'll tell you how to find the square root of 10 plus same thing goes here square root of 729 is 27 divided by square root of 100 is 10 so now to find the square root of 10 it goes like this so square root of 10 is so the closest perfect square to 10 is 9 so which is 3 times so 3 square is 9 and 10 minus 9 is 1 difference is 1 divided by 3 double this 3 so which is 6 so this is like a trick method to find the square root so which is 1 divided by 6 so 1 divided by 6 is 6 1 so add a decimal point add a 0 which is 10 so 6 times 1 is 6 so 4 0 6 times 6 is 36 so difference is 4 so it keeps going like this therefore 3.16 so 1 by 6 value is 0.16 so 3.16 that is the value of square root of 10 so substituting that here so which goes like this so 27 plus 27 you can still ignore all the steps just we can find the answers i just want to teach for the basic weakness so i'm using all the steps so same thing again so to convert this fraction into decimal we have to check for the number of zeros so there is only one zero here so place the decimal point before one digit so the answer is 2.7 and then to divide this one so 27 by 3.16 so it is 27 divided by 3.16 to so decimal division when there is a decimal point in the denominator we have to get rid of that so one two. so since the decimal point is here in the whole number so moving one two so that adds the two zeros on top so which is two seven zero zero divided by 316 so doing the normal regular division so 316 zero, zero. so around 8 times which is 2528 and the difference is 271 so place a decimal point add a 0 here so 1720 which is 5 times around 1580 so the difference is again 041 so add a 0 again so which is around 4 times which is 1 two six four so the difference is one three six so we can stop about two decimal places substituting the value here which is 27 plus 27 divided by 3.16 is 8.54 plus 2.7 so adding this we can get the answer so which is 27 plus 8.54 and 2.7 so you can fill with these blank spaces with zeros if it would be confusing for you so 7 plus 5 is 12 one so the decimal point so it is 18 and 3 so 38.24 is the answer the options which is closest to the answer we got here is 38.23 so therefore square root of 729 plus square root of 72.9 plus square root of 7.29 is 38.23 thanks for watching if you have any doubts please let me know in the comments